Tusonge mbele hali ya taharuki imetanda katika eneo la Kamagut County ya Wasingisho. Baada ya watu wanne kuuawa karibu na kituo cha wanajeshi baada ya madai kuibuka kuwa palikuwa na mvurugano baina yao na wanajeshi karibu na shamba la mahindi, milia wanne hao yamepatikana katika sehemu tofauti karibu na kituo hicho wengine wakiuguza majeraha ya risasi huku kamishna mkuu wa eneo la Tarbo akia nikisha kwamba palikuwepo na mvutano Elvis Kosgei na maelezo zaidi kuta ni watu watatu wamekufa kidogo tukateremuka pale chini tukaenda kupata watu imeongezeka imekuwa waine na vijana yenye ilikuwa amepata injury ni karibu wa vijana tano wengine ambaye mimi nafikiria saa hii wamepelekwa revival ima hapa imetushangaza kwa maana tumekaa kwa hii shamba lakini miaka yote tumekaa kwa usalama lakini hii mwaka tu ndio ametuletea maafa. Tumekaa nao vizuri. But last year eh, maafa ilitokea hapa ambapo waliua watu. So this year wameanza sasa hivyo kwa sababu eh, ukipata kama wanavuna mahindi, jua vijana wenye wanaandikwa kama farm guard. Ni vijana wenye wanaandikwa wachunge mahindi. Na sasa ni vile tulikuwa tunasema eh, kulingana na au farm guard wanapigia au watu wa KDF wakuje hao wakikuja sasa ndi wanapiga raia unapata sasa hata sisi kama sisi tumemaliza ngombe yetu hapa ngombe waki, wa, wana, 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 wana chukua ngombe wakipata mtu anachunga ngombe wanapiga yeye wanapeleka ngombe this is an organized a choreographed move by some few calibers in the military in the leadership that they still want to succeed the agenda ya wale watu wengine Yeah. And even no wonder why Uru is coming back now. Uru amekuja ametoka juzi ameenda kule ukambani. He is a retired president. We have never seen a retired president who comes back actively in politics. Who knows? Maybe his sympathizers are the one executing this one. Yes. How can you separate that? Yes. How can you separate that? That could be a systematic organized way of frustrating this government and to discredit this government from its own people. And we want to say we are against this one and we will not accept this one. Watu wanne akiwa mkijana wa miaka 7 wamefariki kwenye ajali